You were having a nightmare. Same one you used to have all the time. About what happened at the ranch. I'll be okay. Just give me a minute. Hey, what do you have there? Did you have a bad dream too? You've been having them a lot lately. I feel safer like this, not sleeping. I want to stay up forever. I probably could. Like 18 days, if I tried hard. We're safe here, AJ. It doesn't feel like it. You used to think so. Ah! Here, let me help you back to bed. No. You don't have to keep checking on me. You always say, be tough. So I am. You say, be strong. And I will. All the time. You're the toughest boy I know. Probably the toughest boy in the whole world. Not as tough as you. Well, no one's as tough as me. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to do all the hard work. Showing them I'm good and smart. Smarter than them. I'm gonna help you more, so you don't have to do everything. Where are you going? On patrol. Patrol? For danger. Bad people, monsters, whatever you have nightmares about. What if you stayed here instead? If you go back to sleep, I'll stay awake and make sure no more bad dreams come. You can't do that. You're not magic. <laughs> How do you know? Maybe I have magic and never told you. <laughs> no, you don't. What is it? Can I... Could I maybe sleep in your bed? Like I did when I was little? Yeah. Come on up. I I'm not scared. Just tired. Makes sense to me. Think you need that? AJ? What? You're still little. Yeah, I know. <sighs> you ready to work today, kiddo? Bad dreams always make me more tired. Me too. I slept better in your bed. It's my turn to be lookout. I have other stuff I need to do. What stuff? Nothing. It's just... It's important. God damn it, Lewis. Take this seriously for once in your life. I've been taking this seriously for fucking days. Almost two weeks. So has everyone. Get over yourself. Hey. I thought Lily and Abel would show up days ago. I wonder why they're holding off. Don't know. All I wanted was more time to prepare, but now this waiting sucks and everyone's on edge. Need my help? Yeah, actually. Could you check on everyone and make sure they're doing shit right? Sure, I'm on it. Thanks, Clem. I should go board up the back hallway, since Lewis isn't gonna do it.
Pretty clear message. Shit. What's going on? In a few weeks, or days, or hours, the raiders will be here. Burn down our place and steal or kill us. And then it won't matter how much I sucked at this. The raiders aren't gonna burn anything or steal anybody. We'll stop it. You sound like Marlin. I mean, not about fighting, but when he was trying to cheer us all up. For years I sat around making stupid jokes, playing stupid games. While my best friend was left with all the responsibility, all the tough calls, all the sleepless nights, and eventually, a bullet in the head. And I didn't do a damn thing about it. And then when you tried to tell us what he was really like, and AJ shot him, I blamed you. Both of you. If I could take it back, I would. I knew that the day you got back, I, I still do. I forgive you. I understand why you did it. I'm not angry. He was my best friend, almost like my brother, but the things he did, they were fucked up. Here, you take it. Are you sure? I mean, it's Marlin's. Yeah, it was. And he used it to defend the school before... before he stopped. Go ahead. Try it. In that direction, please. And just so you know, I'm totally laughing out loud when you miss. Okay. During the fight, ask all the raiders to stand still about a foot away from you. It wasn't that bad. Fine. I need some practice. Told you you couldn't be worse than me. Good news. We're the worst together. You want to come back and practice more? Just let me know. Okay? <laughs> Sounds good. And Clem? Thank you. For all of it. Still wouldn't want to pledge to that. Do you think Sophie and Minnie might be with them when they get here? I don't know. Maybe. I'm doing watch, Clem, for danger. Like patrol? No, Clem. Lookout's totally different than patrol. How so? You don't walk. Oh, right. Hey, what are you doing? Mm, test. Gotta see if the bomb will go off. This little thing won't kill anybody. Just gotta see if it'll light. Yeah, it better. Our whole plan rests on that little thing. If they get in, I'll need you to set the bomb off while I distract them. Expect the unexpected. Yeah, something like that. I, I read that on one of those stupid inspirational posters. <laughs> School used to have them everywhere. As soon as things went to shit, I tore them all down. Stupid shit. Uh, could you? Uh, my hands all fucked up from messing with it all day. Stand back. Fucking shit. If it doesn't work. Fucking shit! <sighs> Great. We're totally fucking fucked. I'll figure it out. 
I just need more time. Alone time to think. I get it. I'll leave you alone. Thanks, though. For helping. Back hallway's secure. How is everyone? Okay, or, you know, a total fucking mess. Well, honestly, it's not perfect. But they're trying. They're doing everything they can. Trying isn't gonna stop them from getting kidnapped. Trying isn't going to stop these raiders from burning down our fucking home. Jesus, Clem. They stopped giving out participation trophies when walkers started eating people. Because you're boring and your idea is stupid. Oh, I'm being stupid? You're the one who can't think straight. If you could hear yourself- Guys, what the fuck? Violet told us to work on the traps together, but a sim won't listen to anything I say. That doesn't mean you have to scream at each other. Stay out of this. I have an idea for duffel bags filled with bricks. We drop them on the raiders if they get to the admin building. Willie here wants to use a giant idiotic swinging log to take out one raider at most. It's completely stupid. You're stupid. You're being childish. I am not. I'm trying to help. So help and stop arguing. Asim is right. We should use his brick trap. It sounds more practical. Mine's practical too. No, it isn't. It's exactly the kind of thing a child would think of. Especially a child who has no idea what he's up against. <laughs> what the shit? Dude, you okay? Yeah, fine. Shit. Christ. We'll all kill each other before the raiders even get a fucking chance. All right, what we need is something to break the tension. Hey, buddy, how's it hanging? Dude, fuck off. Sulking in the corner isn't gonna help us fight off the raiders. Or turn that frown upside down. You get more annoying every day. Regardless, I've come up with a plan to make everybody feel better. And that plan is a game. Come on, we gotta play. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, we haven't played a game in weeks since that night with Marlin. I mean, if you want to go ask Ruby to come play, I don't mind waiting. Shut up, dude! I swear to God. You've got a crush on Ruby? What are we playing? Truth or Dare. You don't use cards in Truth or Dare. You do in this version. Everyone draws. Highest card gets to ask, lowest card has to answer. <laughs> this should be good. Let's see. Truth. Marry, fuck, kill. Bye. Fine. Marry, flip, kill. Ruby, a sim, or James, that guy who saved you. <sighs> oh my god. You gotta answer. Them's the rules. Let's see. I would marry... A sim. I, uh, thanks? I don't think you're his type. He's into redheads. Dude, shut <laughs> up. I would, um, flip. Flip, 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 flip. Flip, 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 flip. Ruby. <laughs> what? Sorry. I was just imagining her glare while Clem propositions her. What? You sure that's a good idea? What's wrong with you? She picked. Ruby gets a flip. So that means you're killing... This is amazing. Boy from the woods! I'll try to shed a tear for the poor boy none of us met, who's probably just a figment of Clem's imagination. No, he's not. I met him. Well, now he's dead. Poor dude. This is great. We're laughing, we're bonding. It's a nice break from thinking about homicidal assholes sneaking into our homes to kidnap us. Not if you bring it up. On to round two. I win. And poor Sim loses. Definitely a dare. Uh, okay. Do your worst. You have to kiss... A walker. What? No way. Gotta play by the rules, my dude. That's like... I could die. Avoid the teeth. 
Go for the cheek. Ugh, gross. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't breathe. I hate everyone. That was amazing. Well, I think we all learned something about our good friend Asim today. Mainly that he has no romantic charm whatsoever. Shut up. Look sharp, y'all. It's time for round three. I got it. We've been pretty hard on poor Asim here, teasing him about sweet Ruby. Seems only fair we mercilessly tease someone else about unrequited love. So, Clem. Anyone here you like-like? Seriously? Like-like? What are you, six? Seven, thank you. <sighs> yeah, I've definitely got feelings for someone. Oh, oh who is it? <laughs> nope, not telling. It could be anyone. Mitch, Ruby, or a Sim. You know, since she said she'd marry you and all. I, uh... You're nice enough, Clementine, but I don't think... Please stop. <laughs> a Sim! You've got the high card. And the loser is... Tennessee. What's something you've never told anyone because you were afraid they'd make fun of you? You got this. I, um... I, I think... I think walkers won't always be around. They'll go away someday. Cause the world goes in cycles, right? Ice Age, Stone Age, um, some other ages. So it's like that. This age will end. And another one will start. An age without walkers? Like it used to be. It'll be better. Why is everyone looking at me like that? Did I ruin the game? That's... really beautiful. I never thought of it that way. What's wrong, AJ? Uh, I just don't know what it's like. All of you do, but I don't. I don't remember a time before monsters. You know what, little dude? It's okay that you don't. Believe me, the world before this one was pretty shitty. And that feels like a good place to call it. We should finish up our work anyway. It's getting dark. You're on lookout? Yep. Clementine's got it after me. Can I come? Of course you can, little guy. Hey. Hey. You maybe want to help me with the brick trap? Yeah, I got some ideas. Cool. I'm sure they'll help. Sorry I punched you. It's okay. It's a pretty good punch. I'm headed to the bell tower. I want to check out our defenses on the back wall before bed. Do you need help? Sure, if you want. You could always help me instead. I am on piano duty. What? I gotta get in some practice before one of you decides to chop it into firewood. I've got a project I want to try, but I need a second person. So, we're checking the walls? Yep, from up there. That's the best view. You ready for a climb? <sighs> Looks a little dangerous. 
<laughs> What's more dangerous than walkers? Or that death trap you called a car? Okay, fair. Come on, you're not chicken, right? <laughs> no. Now I'm thinking about chicken nuggets. Do you remember those? Not really. I do. We always got them on Sundays. There was no time for Grandma to cook between church and Bible study, so fast food. Damn, I'd give an eyeball for a chicken nugget right now. Barbed wire, traps, weapons, it's everything we planned. You made it happen. We couldn't have done it without you. You've got lookout duty tonight, right? Yep, me and AJ. Do you have time to hang out first? Sure. Beautiful. Sometimes I need the quiet just to get away for a while. Clem. Yeah? I know you came back for medicine, for AJ, but after that you could have just left. Avoided all the bullshit with the raiders. Why didn't you? Sorry, I know that puts you on the spot. You don't have to answer. We've all got our reasons. AJ and I are safer here. Lily and Abel proved that. Yeah, that's true. Until they get here, anyway. Do you know any constellations? Nope. You? I learned some in school, but can't remember them. Let's make some up. Come over here. You can sit down at that volunteer death. If I remember right, everyone's born under a special sign. Right? It determines your personality? That's astrology, not astronomy. Whatever, let's just make up our own. Rules, signs, what it says about you. It's not like anyone remembers the old way. Okay, let's do it. There! See? It's a fish. Right. Now it needs a personality. Bright, pretty, good with other people, always moving, tons of energy. Sounds like anyone we know. The energy one is easy. Good with people, not so much. That's AJ. Wherever I look, there he is, taking up all my attention. And I love him for it. He's getting better around other people. You're doing good with him. Next up. I spy with my eye a knife. See it? Mm, right there. Right above your head. Yeah, they're all above my head. Awesome. This one's easy. Smart, clean, vicious, dependable. Someone you want with you in a fight. Doesn't take crap from anyone. Gets shit done. Sounds just like you. Uh, I like that one. Yeah. Okay, one more time. I found a bird. Like a real bird? No, a star bird. Right there.
A bird is free. It could go anywhere it wanted to, up and up and up and never come back. Go south, east, west, doesn't matter. You could fly straight into a sunset and see where it ends. It's all of us. Everyone here wishes they could fly away from all of this. Maybe we'll learn to fly together someday. Sorry, I didn't mean to just talk so much. It's just I've watched people leave before. Family, friends, they never come back. But you did, and now I can't imagine what it would be like if you weren't here. Um... Shit. That sounds so much dumber when I say it out loud. We're friends. Good ones. It's good to have a friend again. Someone I can really trust. So do we gotta, like, make friendship bracelets or something? I don't think it's official until we do. Ugh, I hate arts and crafts. Bye! Clam, you out here? Shit sticks. Probably time for your lookout shift. Ready? Yeah. The Raiders. That guy. He's gonna be with them. Abel. Yeah. Your bad dreams. They're all about him, aren't they? Yeah. Can I swear yet? I think it's time I can. If you do. Fuck it. Really? Go for it, kiddo. Everyone else swears, you might as well, too. I fucking really hate that fucking dickhead shit fuck. Whoa, that's a little much, don't you think? <laughs> Try thinking about something else. Count the monsters you see. Same number as before. Three, four... AJ, it's okay if Abel frightens you. You know how to control that. There's ten monsters out there. And he doesn't frighten me. But when he comes here, I call dibs. I'm the one that kills him. Okay? Okay. Really? Yes, I can't promise you how things are gonna go. But if it's possible... You get first shot at him. Wow. What, you thought I'd say no? Yeah. I'm grown up now. No, you aren't. But I'm close. Clem, I see something. Not a walker? Here, you look too. Not a walker. Good job, AJ. Come on, we have to tell the others. <laughs> 